Hi guys, today I'm going to show you our new Smart Control Live uh, software. Uh, so let's go to the demo room and uh, I'll show you where to get it. If you go on our homepage and then to support Smart Control Live, uh, you'll be able to find our new page for Smart Control Live, which explains how uh, it works and what you can do with it. Um, and at the bottom, uh, you can find the download button. And you can also find uh, uh, a little manual that uh, further explains how to use it. To in, uh, uh, install the new smart control, uh, double click the file you just downloaded, give it uh, administer rights, uh, click next, go through the, the setup wizard. If you want shortcuts, click them, uh, and then click install. Uh, to use the new uh, smart control update, uh, you will have to update your firmware. Uh, you do this by uh, clicking on select firmware file, it'll open the correct folder. You select uh, the firmware, and that's it. And you start the updater. Uh, this will show you a couple of steps. The most difficult one I will show you in a second. Uh, for the firmware update, uh, you will have to push down this button uh, while you are reconnecting uh, the little controller box. Um, so you press in the button, and then you reconnect the cable. That's all you have to do. This works the same on the other pedals as well. Uh, on the handbrake, you can find the button. Also next to the USB port, so you push the button down and the USB cable in. On the sprint uh, brake pedal, uh, you have to push the button in carefully so it doesn't break, and that's it. Uh, a big change to our uh, new firmware is that the latency has improved by about 80%, uh, so the pedals will feel a bit more responsive. Uh, to assign new functions in our Smart Control Live software, um, I want to increase my brake force while I'm racing, for example. Um, so I click on the plus, uh, and then I select increase brake force. I want to add five kilos to it. Click on next, and then uh, you assign whichever button you want to assign. In this case, is rotary, and that's it. And now I can increase my brake force uh, while on the fly. Uh, I hope this has gotten you up and running with the new smart control software. Uh, if you've used any of the cool features or have any ideas, please let us know in the comments. Uh, or if you have any questions about how it works, uh, ask us as well. Uh, and keep uh, tuned for uh, some next videos where we go a bit more in depth. And thank you for watching.